Okay, so this is a review of my FM backm board Hamdi edition H A M D I. Uh, price point four hundred dollars from eBay. Uh, right off the bat, uh, with this board, probably out of the three I have or four I have right now, uh, it's either my number one or my number two. Uh, depending on how much I like the uh, FTH board, I haven't played on it yet, so I'll let you know. But first thing is, comes with a nice, handsome leather carrying case. Um, this alone, I think it's probably easily eighty to hundred dollars, so that's a nice touch from FM Gammon. Uh, the board itself, it's on the heavy side. I would probably say it's uh, close to. Darn near 20 pounds, I would say. So it's not a board that I would travel with. Uh, you know, it's something you want to keep at home or or if you want to keep it at your hotel room during a tournament, something like that. Okay, so right off the bat, measurements. Uh, let's see. Okay, so closed. We're at about 20, a little under 23 inches, so 22 and three quarters. By about 15 and a half, so good size board. Uh, this, these Hamdi ones are made out of press board material. Okay, gonna open it up. Okay, board comes with Dublin cube, uh, wooden dice cups, a uh, scoreboard, uh, plastic scoreboard. Uh, don't know where it is at the moment, but it does come with a scoreboard. Uh, it did come with dice, not precision dice, that fit snugly into this box. Uh, this cube alone, I think they list them for about eighty to ninety dollars on eBay. Uh, nice little dice cube. Okay, uh, acrylic checkers. I believe these are the same ones they used on the uh, UBC uh, championship because uh, they look exactly the same. And I know FM are the ones that make the boards for uh, back and galaxy really like the sound this uh, board makes Now for the positives, uh, first off, I really like this uh, felt, nice and smooth, uh, has printed uh, stitched lining here, uh, colors are nice and vibrant, uh, the felt is like a nice uh, navy type of blue, really smooth, uh, looks durable. Uh, checkers, really well made, constructed, have a nice marble look to them. 1.75 inches all right and they fit really snugly into their place no issues there like I said with my art gammon review the checkers on the art gammon do not fit or not all of them fit snugly into their slot um, so that tells me that the art gammon checkers aren't all equally the same size um, Okay. Second or third thing I really like this about this board is uh, the overall uh, construction. Uh, nice hefty board. There's nothing that's glued on anywhere. The handle is nice and sturdy. Um, 
very well made. Really obvious when you open this board, when you first get it, when you unbox it, it's really well made. So I'm really, really happy with uh, the quality of FM. Um, so overall, great board. Now the only thing I would best this board would be their walnut or mahogany wood, which is, you know, they're, I think they're selling for like eight or nine hundred dollars now. But compared to the price point of this board, which is 400, I think this is a very, very good value. <clears throat> All right, now for the negatives. I really only have one negative with the FN, with this particular board, and those are the dice cups. They are a little on the small, small side, and they feel slippery to me. So when you shake them, your fingers sort of start sliding upwards depending on how you shake I like to put two fingers on top um, I see some people shake them like this so I don't think that'll be an issue with them but if you're a more aggressive shaker like I tend to be uh, you kind of want a little more grip to your shaker so when I use this board I tend to use the uh, Wycliffe Brothers um, dice cups um, so that's the only complaint I have about this board um, if you want to reach out to Anur, I believe his name is O N U R through Facebook or uh, eBay, he might be able to um, cut you a deal <clears throat> on a board. Really great guy. Uh, so let's give these guys a few uh, shapes. Three one. So you like that sound it makes? Nice, you know, command sound. Okay, so if you see my other reviews, you'll notice that the sound this one makes is, I like the sound, I like the nice loud sound of banging other dice on the bumpers. Uh, my style 3-1. Okay, it's a really nice looking board, really nice construction. Not go wrong going with the FM Gammon board. Uh, all right, thanks for watching.